So the new iPhones, they might have a trick up their sleeves. Something that we've been waiting for for a long time and um, we've been anticipating, it never came, it never came. 2019 passed, 2020 passed, we're in 2021. And maybe it is time for us to get that really cool feature that we've been all wanting for. Two things that are gonna happen to the iPhone 13. What's up, Lollipop? My name is Joe, and in today's episode, iPhone 12 is old news. No one cares about it anymore. iPhone 12 Pros and Pro Maxes and Minis and Normals are out the window. We don't need them anymore. What we do need is the new iPhone, and we want it now. There are some features that we will be getting with this year's phones. Um, or feature and one drawback. Let me explain. First of all, the drawback. And when I say the drawback, you're gonna know exactly what I'm talking about, uh, what the feature is. The phone is going to be 0 0.26 millimeters thicker than the pre uh, than these year's models, or this year's models, or last year's models. I don't know, I'm still in January. 2020 is still this year, and 2021 is still next year, although it's not. Anyway, we are going to get a thicker iPhone. Why could this be? Why are we getting a thicker iPhone? Well, there's a really simple, easy explanation. It's a bigger battery. And while we have seen that the iPhone 12 lacks the battery life of the iPhone 11 because of the 5G chip, because of some other circumstances, this year, even though we're gonna get a bigger battery, we might not get a better battery life. What we do want in a phone and what we've been waiting for is 120 hertz displays. And if you've ever used one of these, this is an iPad Pro, or if you've ever used any premium Android phone on the market, well then you know what 120 hertz refresh rate means. It means that the fluidity of your content on your screen is just amazing. It's very easy and very cool to consume things on 120 hertz displays. It's more fluid, it's more everything. I mean, the, the world is a happier place when you're looking at it through 120 hertz. Now, we've been waiting for this 2019, 2020, and finally we're in 2021, it might happen. And all things point towards this happening because you have a thicker phone with a bigger battery. Why do we need a bigger battery? To support the 120 hertz displays which consume a lot of energy. Apple was very close to bringing this to us in 2020. They couldn't because the displays took up too much energy and the drawbacks for the battery life were too much and they couldn't allow this to happen. 2021 is the year when we're gonna get a modified version of the iPhone 12. Some say it's gonna be the iPhone 13. I personally believe it's gonna be the iPhone 12 S. Speed is always the S, so a speedier display. Hmm, maybe a better processor. Hmm, obviously, every year. Camera, they're gonna to touch, but not so much. That's for 2022 is when they tinker with the cameras because this is what happens every freaking year. First, you get the redesign, then you got the speed improvements, and the third year you get the better camera and extra features. This is the three year rotation Apple has with its designs. All right, so what should we do? Yeah, absolutely nothing. These are leaks and rumors from different sources. Some trusted, some are not, but um, I mean, Apple does make you wait a long, long time for things that you really, really want in order for these things to feel really special. And when they introduce it, they're gonna make it like they invented it. Although they were one of the first products to have 120 hertz displays, iPad Pro 2018. Um, yeah. Also, very important to note is Apple will be getting these displays, not from LG, not from another manufacturer. They will be getting these displays from Samsung. They placed a major order in for OLED displays, the small OLED displays. What could it be? I know, you know, we know. iPhone 12S with 120 Hertz displays. Thank you very much, guys. This was an episode of Apple Pie. My name was Joe. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to win an iPhone 12 Pro Max, stay tuned to this channel, subscribe. Until my next video, stay safe and hang with